Hey boss, I got you. Let me just get this thing real quick. What are you doing here? Why are you in my office? Bro, can I get some privacy? No. No. Get out of right. What's up, Roro fam? I hope you guys are having a great day today. Stay tuned to the end of the video if you guys want to see what I'm thankful for. And I think you guys will like it. Thank you. Now, before we continue, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Help your boy out. Remember this. We're special people. And special people help each other. <laughs> so go do that. <laughs> so, so, so. Ah! Ah! Why are you running? Everyone knows that Thanksgiving is this week. So, guys, put in my heart. You know, to talk about thanks, giving thanks, being grateful, thankful. Now, the title of today's preaching, teaching, leasing, whatever you want to say is What are you thankful for? Now, a lot of people might say, Caleb, what are you talking about, bro? Everyone knows what they're thankful for. Like, I'm thankful for everything, bro. Like, duh, Caleb. But some people be thankful for the wrong things. Some people be thankful for the right thing. What are you thankful for? For example, there's people in this world, they're thankful for their family, they're thankful for their friends, they're thankful for the food that they eat. But there's a lot of people who are thankful for drugs, who are thankful for clubs, drinking, and all that stuff. Crack is whack. We gotta set this straight that the devil has created those things to destroy us. Little by little, it destroys each and every one of us that uses those substances. But not only that, a lot of people are thankful for friends that influence them to do the wrong things. A lot of people are thankful for family members that let them do wrong things. You have to open your eyes and realize exactly what you are grateful, thankful for. Because if you don't realize what you are thankful for, if you don't realize what you're grateful for, what's important in your life, then you're gonna be valuing the wrong things. If you value a toxic friend, you're thankful for them, but you don't even realize it, you're just gonna be messing up yourself. Yeah, yeah. You need to do a self-analysis and realize what you are doing. Now, I know it may be tough for a lot of people to realize what exactly they should be thankful for. Cause a lot of people are so used to how their life is and they already have value in certain things that it's just hard to take that away from them. But I got a verse right here. And this is something that everyone can be thankful for. Say everyone, everyone, everyone. Everyone. Everyone go to Psalms 107, 21. I'll give you guys a second. Okay, let's start. Let them give thanks to the Lord for his unfailing love and his wonderful deeds for mankind. Mankind? So that means everyone can be thankful for what God has done in their life, waking them up to a new day, eating food on their plate, <laughs> going to school, hanging out with friends. And sadly, a lot of people take that for granted. I'll be the first one guilty, trust me. And sometimes I'll be using my phone and I'm like, you know how many people have Android? Trash. <laughs> iPhone gang, iPhone gang. For it all, I'm thankful. A lot of times that slips our head. Having food on our plate slips, it just passes us by. But if you go to third world countries, bro, they don't even got food like that. But even though a lot of those people in third world countries, let's say they have less food, less clothes or all that, a lot of them are way happier than we are. I just like to smile, smiling's my favorite. Because if we go one day without our phone, a lot of people start tripping. They say, oh my God, look at my phone. One day without food, people will be tripping, crying, literally suffering. Literally just having clothes on our body, bro. People don't even have clothes for themselves. By the way, my parents got me a new jacket and I am thankful, grateful for it. Cause this junk is sexy. Hey yo, y'all saw the first clip, how nice I was in there? But for real though, a lot of times that just slips our mind. God is using me right now to tell you to not let those things slip your mind. Every single day, thank God. Start your prayer with thanking him. That's what I usually do. Whether you, you value the wrong things, whether you value bad friends, drugs, or whatever, all of us, even those people, can be thankful for God. God has given them the ability to move, the ability to talk, the ability to just do multiple things. And one last thing real quick that you should be thankful for is all the hard times that have happened in your life. 
all the times you've ever been depressed, sad, just been going through something terrible because those moments have molded you to who you are today. Without those moments, who knows where you would be right now? Without those moments and learning how to overcome those situations, you would still be way far behind at, you would be your old self being dumb and making dumb decisions. So you're telling me there's a chance. But God has allowed that in your life for you to learn, to be able to do more. I'll be the first one to tell you guys, with all the hard things I've gone through in my life, I am a way better person than I was before. I know it may be hard to be thankful for those hard moments and situations, but trust me, you need to be thankful for them. Without those moments, you wouldn't be right here watching me do this video. So thanks for watching, like and subscribe. But to finish this video, watch what you guys are thankful for and make sure you are thankful for the right things. Make sure you are doing the right things and also be thankful for all the hard times that have been in your life. Because without that, you wouldn't be you. And that is what makes you unique. I'm ready! And don't forget, you're amazing, wonderful, sexy. Yo, that turkey sexy though. Ooh, hey, 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 comment down below. How many of you guys are gonna gain like 10 pounds in Thanksgiving? I always do. It's okay, watch my gym vlogs. I'm fat and sassy. With all that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you guys learned something from it. So, until next time guys, Aurora fans. Oh, you're part of my fam. Aurora fam, you part of my... I'm so sorry. Yo, hey, you're welcome anytime. But hey, hey, I'm thankful for you though. I'm thankful. And for real though, hey, all the people who watch my videos, I am so thankful for you guys watching and supporting. It means so much to me. And if there's one thing I'm thankful for, is you guys. Because without you, there is no channel. Without you, there is no videos. So thank you for everything. And yeah, have a good day, guys.